Hey everyone, what's up? It's Rob. We are back at Polymer Summit day two. It is lunchtime, so everyone here is in the uh, lounge having lots of delicious snack -a -lax. There's also people playing uh, foosball behind us. If you hear some crazy sounds, that's what that is. Uh, I'm joined by Fred Schott. Fred is a software engineer on the Polymer team. Uh, Fred, you just got done doing part of the tools keynote, and as part of that, you were talking about Polymer CLI. So um, for folks who, who haven't heard of that before, can you maybe tell them just briefly, like, like what is Polymer CLI and, and, and kind of like, how is that going to make them a bit more productive? Sure, sure thing. Um, the Polymer CLI is your gateway into the R tool chain. So it lets you create new projects really easily, helps you through the entire developer flow from testing to linting to uh, serving your application. And finally, it helps you build a web app for production. So optimize it, um, all, those, all that stuff. Um, so yeah, it's really your gateway into all these tools. And as, as part of the keynote, you were mentioning that folks can create their own generators for Polymer CLI. Um, so you can talk a, a little bit about that. Like if, if, if I want to you know, learn how to do that, uh, where would I kind of go to get started? Yeah, sure. So um, check out the Polymer CLI on GitHub. It has a ton of information for all these things that it includes. Um, for new templates, you can, well, I definitely recommend checking out the ones that exist already. Yeah. So search Polymer init anywhere on NPM, and you'll get a whole list of everything that exists. Um, to create your own, it's really easy. It's based off Yeoman, which is this really common uh, generator tool. And so anything that works with that, it's the exact same process. You just build out a new template like you would for anything. Now, uh, if I want to go and, and get started using Polymer CLI, uh, where's, my, where's my jumping off point? Um, definitely check out Polymer CLI and the build library on NPM and uh, GitHub as well. The readme has a ton of information. Um, yeah. Cool, awesome. So uh, for those of you uh, who haven't done so yet, be sure to go catch that tools keynote featuring Fred, uh, Polymer CLI, and a bunch of other really cool announcements in that video. All right, so Fred, thank you so much for, for being with us today. Uh, if you haven't done so yet, be sure to catch Fred's talk and the entire tools keynote. There's a bunch of great announcements in there. Uh, we're going to keep, keep doing uh, live updates from the floor at Polymer Summit 2016, so please stay with us. Also, ping us on Twitter at hashtag Polymer Summit if you've got any questions or concerns or anything like that. Uh, I'm Rob. Stay with us.